hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel this is your girl adriana dc tonight's video is going to be a very exciting video. i'm going to be giving you guys my top 10 tropical beachy fragrances in my collection i think that i am at this point definitely anticipating summer vibes vacation vibes i want i'm looking forward to it I don't know you guys this week has definitely like excited me a little bit i'm really into just getting out there letting my hair down <laughs> bringing out my you know um my little you know crop tops and like you know letting my shoulders out and stuff like that i'm definitely looking forward to you know um bringing on the summer vibes or summer vacation vibes or tropical beachy vibes even though i'm so far away from the beach so i have 10 fragrances in my collection that i think are definitely beautiful tropical beachy fragrances when i smell these perfumes even though i'm in the freezing cold and so far away from home the these fragrances definitely give me the vibes of you know tropical beachy you know holiday and endless summer vibes. So if you guys are interested in hearing about my top 10 tropical beachy fragrances then by all means keep on watching if you guys are new here please don't forget to hit that subscribe button make sure to hit that notification bell so that way you will be notified every single time i upload and for those of you who are my returning subscribers thank you guys for supporting me i truly appreciate your support so let's just get right into it the first tropical beachy fragrance in my collection is none other than light blue intense you guys now let me tell y'all there is no tropical beachy list without light blue intense you guys you get that citrusy boss of zesty lemons mixing with that granny smith apple that you cannot get enough of in these fragrances there is some musk there's some sweet jasmine in the heart of this fragrance but all you get is granny smith apples some citrusy lemons i do get the marigold in here so and there is a musk in this fragrance that kind of like gives this fragrance somewhat of a skin like essence a skin like essence that makes this fragrance this smells like tropical beachy skin it smells like like fresh out of the beach skin that's what this perfume smells like the dry down just gets you even more and i don't know something about this perfume it just gives me life you guys this is a very exciting fragrance definitely gives you tropical beachy vibes as a matter of fact if you guys know me you know dolce and cabana is my summer essentials there is no summer without dolce and cabana there is no tropical beachy scent without dolce and cabana being listed in it because dolce and cabana is just summer you guys so for me you, this is definitely a staple of my collection when i think about tropical beachy fragrances so this is my first fragrance that i would recommend as a beautiful tropical beachy fragrance next we have juliet has a gun vanilla vibes now look at it oh my god have you guys are you guys seeing this i mean i know you guys are probably thinking like what are you talking about adrian do you see how this bottle looks like it looks like the skies and this looks like the sea and it looks like um it's gradually ascending into the sand did you guys notice that before i mean i know this bottle gives you like it's you know vanilla vibes it's beachy or whatever but this literally looks like a view a profile of the sky like light blue skies with sparkling crystal blue waters and as it comes to the shore it gets lighter and the essence of the sand unless that's just my hand <laughs> either way you put it <laughs> either way you put it you guys this fragrance right here vanilla vibes this is the essence of a tropical beach day this is a beachy salty sweet vanilla fragrance it smells like suntan lotion okay it smells like suntan lotion it smells like holidays it smells like oh my god i don't know <sighs> If I can properly put this into words, but if 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 you guys have not smelled this perfume, you need to smell it. Like it is such a beautiful, sweet, salted vanilla fragrance that smells tropical. It smells like suntan lotion. It smells like you've been, you know, it smells like you've just taken a dip in the water and you come out of the water. And this is, you know, obviously you're exposed to the sunshine. So your skin smells like the essence of um, salt water uh, mixing with that sunshine with a, mix, a bit of sweetness to it. Like, 
that's what it smells like and it is definitely a sweet smelling fragrance it is pretty i don't find it to be overly clying okay there is a very generous dose of sweetness to this perfume even though it's salty but it's a powdery scent that dries on and it kind of clings to your skin really well it just like marries to your skin i'm guessing because the salty essence mixing with your chemistry kind of goes quite well but it's so beautiful you guys like i'm telling you i cannot wait to just like i've already sprayed myself with the um you know the dolce Gabbana light blue intense which is why i can't dose myself in this perfume but i look forward to wearing this fragrance the perfume has also somewhat of a breezy essence to it it smells breezy as well so it, do it doesn't just smell like you know salty um sweet vanilla um skin it smells breezy you get the essence a breeze blowing as well with the mixture with the essence of sunshine on your skin and you know salt water whatever i think it's such a beautiful fragrance you guys this is definitely you know the epitome of tropical beachy you know vibes in my opinion so yeah Juno has a gun is definitely a fragrance i would recommend as a tropical beachy scent to pull for during the summer months you guys next we have la nuit Trésor nude you guys and for me again this is one of my favorite coconut fragrances okay and even though it hasn't a very strong dose of coconut there is something citrusy sharp and juicy about this coconut with a slight essence of saltiness okay this perfume it smells tropical there is a tropical feel to it yeah it smells like a citrusy, juicy, um, um, coconut scent. Now, this perfume is not just for the beach. This fragrance can be worn out as well. But something about this perfume, it smells juicy and sweet, okay? The coconut in here almost comes across a little bit syrupy sweet. But the citrusy elements in here, so it's like really juicy. Mixing with the lemons and the coconut. I think there are some florals in here so, as well. But this is a citrusy sharp juicy tropical sweet coconutty smelling fragrance with this slight presence of a saltiness to this perfume a very slight essence to it and i want to say i love this perfume like this perfume smells so good you guys this fragrance almost smells like really sexy to me i think this fragrance is actually a sexy you know um tropical beachy fragrance in my opinion it's again this is a nice fragrance that you can it's versatile in my opinion it you don't have to wear it to the beach alone it can be worn out it can be worn evenings i would say it could wear in the night time as well i love this fragrance and i think it smells next, so next we have Eau de soleil blanc by tom ford and let me just tell you guys let me tell you guys something right something about this perfume I don't know how Tom Ford managed to capture, um, like, it smells like, um, it smells like suntan, it smells citrusy, but you have, of course, the neroli, the aromatic, the aromatic essence of this perfume. It smells like suntan, sunshine, coconuts, vacation, holiday, beach vibes it smells like paradise it just smells so tropical and so holiday like it definitely gives you like somewhat of a beachy vibe but this is not like in the water it smells like you're on a beach it smells not just like you know a casual beachy day it smells like you're on a resort it literally has that feel to this fragrance you guys i love the essence of this perfume i think i'm gonna definitely like enjoy this perfume this summer i think because i'm so in you know um anticipating you know hot sunny days and you know summer vibes i look forward to wearing this fragrance but this just gives you tropical beachy vacation holiday summer everything that says sunshine and a bottle type of vibes in my opinion definitely a beautiful tropical beachy fragrance in my collection it's a must-have it's like a summer essential when you think about you know you know summer days definitely a beautiful fragrance to have in your collection so this is your de soleil blanc by tom ford next up we have coconut fizz by Golen, and this is a fresh um lightly this is a fresh a little bit creamy coconut scent that definitely gives you tropical beachy vibes now unlike the other ones this one is not that um it's not that sweet 
right it's a fresh lightly creamy coconut scent coconut fizz definitely gives me that beachy vibe that beachy you know kind of feel and scent to it and i love this perfume oh god i just think the i think these fragrances just come alive i want to literally just spray all over i mean i have so many fragrances on on me already but i literally feel like just spraying this fragrance all over right now you guys i am going to enjoy this fragrance this summer and this perfume again is definitely a you know a tropical beachy vibe you know essential fragrance in my opinion i love this perfume and i think this is definitely a beautiful recommendation for those tropical days or should i say those beachy days or beach nicks or whatever so coconut fizz by um golen beautiful fragrance you know for the summertime next we have dolce and cabana light blue sun which happens to be my favorite from the range let me just tell you mm, this smells so good so this one this one smells a lot more fresher than the uh, than the intense version it is fresher area it is not as sweet because the, the granny sweet apple in here so is not that the granny sweet apple in here so it is not that strong in my opinion there's a lot more going on in here so okay there are some ozonic notes in here with some coconut there's some vanilla this perfume again is my favorite from the range it smells fresher area um a little bit sharper than the original a light essence of coconut in my opinion but it's just overall smells so refreshing you guys it just smells refreshing and because of that those light touches of coconut in here so it gives me tropical beachy vibes definitely gives me tropical beachy vibes it smells like um like your skin it smells like your skin when you come out of the water and you've been laying on the sand for a little bit and the sun is just blazing on your skin that's what this perfume smells like and it dries out on the skin it just smells like it smells like 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 sunshine on your skin you guys i don't know how to describe it, it just smells like your skin but it smells like sunshine skin like beachy sunshine skin like i'm telling you i don't know how else to describe this perfume but there's something so beautiful about these light blue fragrances you guys again these are your summer essentials your beachy vibes your vacation sets you need these you guys if you don't have you need if you don't have any of these fragrances you need to get at least one for the summertime and if you don't want to go for the light blue intense i definitely go for this one because there's something so exciting about this fragrance you guys so dolce gabbana light blue sun definitely a beautiful tropical beachy fragrance in my collection next we have eden rock by christian dior and let me tell you something you guys this perfume kind of caught me by surprise and oh am i in love this literally smells it smells like um obviously it has in some sea salt and mineral notes in here so there are some citrusy elements there's a sweetness in here so that's quite surprising however this smells like it smells like seawater it literally you definitely get the mineral notes essence in here so especially as the fragrance, the fragrance begins to dry down it smells like citrusy sweet like salt water i don't know how that makes if that makes sense it smells like wet skin it smells like you're in the it literally smells like the water like salted water with some citruses in my opinion it definitely smells aquatic but you get the mineral notes very strong in here so it's interesting it smells good dare i say this perfume smells a little bit sexy in my opinion something about this perfume smells a little bit sexy something i don't know what it is I don't know i just like it and i like it a lot there is something else to this perfume you guys but it actually smells like you're in the water you know that kind of way but oh my god it's so beautiful in my opinion i just love this fragrance you guys i really love the way this fragrance smells and of course you want to smell i mean you will already this fragrance makes you smell like how you expect your skin to smell when you come out of the water okay so you're going to be you're going to be going to the beach already smelling like the beach in my opinion pulling for this fragrance and i do like that this fragrance is a little bit more dressy and again contrary to what people say this perfume actually lasts quite decent and it has a sophistication to it it has like a dressiness to it in my opinion oh, i love this perfume you guys definitely a fragrance worth getting your nose on for the summer months you guys so this is eden rock by christian Dior. next we have olympia intense you guys now even though this is an intense version it's not that very intense so don't be scared about that 
but this one is a salted ambery sweet vanilla fragrance a salted ambery sweet vanilla fragrance this is a fragrance that you wear when you're going to the beach but when you're having lunch on the beach you know when you're going to a restaurant that extends to the beach front this is what you wear because it's a bit more again it gets a bit it's a bit more dressy in my opinion a little bit more serious but it still gives you that salted you know beachy vibe it definitely does it gives you that salted somewhat tropical beachy essence to it it is refined it is sweet it is pleasant slightly suntan lotion vibe in my opinion very slight suntan lotion vibe again it's the saltiness in here so that kind of gives me that vibe in my opinion and i love this fragrance but like i said this is a scent that you wear for lunch on the beachfront you know on a restaurant extending onto the beachfront when you get in the sunshine you can have your broad hat on and your sunglasses you might take a stroll on the beach with a, with a, with a glass of um you know pina colada in your hand but this is what you're going to be smelling like you guys so for me olympia intense definitely a beautiful scent for those beachy vibes you know next we have moonlight in heaven by killian and this again is a right so this is a sweet a little bit creamy coconutty um a little bit fruity smelling fragrance it's a sweet warm creamy coconut scent there are some fruity notes in here so some grapefruit in the open it is soft it is sweet and slightly creamy with the essence of coconut now while this one does have like a sweet um like a sweet suntan lotion vibe this is your extra dressy beachy fragrance so this is that woman that goes to the beach with a very elaborate broad hat with the frilly linen maxi dress you know those frilly maxi dress you have a bit of clean cleavage to it but it has like the frilly shoulders and like a really deep um you know um cleavage area and a, a long flooring frilly dress with those bags you know those bags that kind of shape like you take like you take a um a broad hat and you fold it together and you put like a handle you know just picture it with me you guys try your best <laughs> right but that's what comes to mind that overly elaborate person that comes to the boat race or to the beach nick dressed to the nine but she's dressed in the nine in broad hats and florally frilly linen white maxi dresses and some um maybe some um some flip flops but with a pointed toe flip flops so that's what comes to mind this is your dressy beachy vibe in my opinion that's what comes to mind when i think about moonlight in heaven the name itself also reminds me of a boat it's like a bar on the beach back home but it's a nighttime flex so you're on the beach you're having drinks it's actually a bar in a boat that's on the beach and that's what comes to mind everything about this fragrance the name the scent it's like a beachy fragrance but a nighttime beachy fragrance but like you know again it the bar it's all about the bar and the beach vibes but you know just relaxing and tropical and summery at the same time so that's the vibe that I get from moonlight in heaven definitely a beautiful fragrance for those beachy days in my opinion last but by no means least we have twilly your puffer now something about this perfume okay it smells like suntan lotion it smells like a sweet a little bit creamy suntan lotion I don't know how else to explain this perfume to you it smells like a lotion without suntan it smells like a lotion but it smells like suntan lotion and that's pretty much the vibe that i get from this perfume true and true and true it smells like suntan lotion and it smells nice it smells exciting it makes you happy because i mean it's in a not only is it in a bright colorful alluring bottle the smell of suntan lotion just makes you happy i don't know about you but it does for me <laughs> so this has like a suntan lotion vibe and of course what better place than to wear a suntan lotion smelling fragrance but to the beach and that's my vibe but this is suntan lotion um it doesn't smell sunny it smells like suntan lotion vibes when the sun is about to like you know like in the evening like about four five o'clock when you go to the beach and you probably want to just take a soak in the water whatever the case is 
or you know um you promised the kids that you'll go to the beach but you didn't get a chance to take them early in the day because you were home washing but you decided to go to the beach in the afternoon just before the sun sets and this is how you would smell that's how i feel in my opinion and this is the vibe that this fragrance is giving me so yeah truly ear pop definitely a beachy vibe it definitely gives me beachy vibes in my opinion you guys so this is the last of the 10 fragrances that i wanted to give you guys today I do hope you guys enjoyed these selections. If in fact you did, please do give me a big thumbs up. I hope you guys are looking forward to summer as much as me and getting your fragrances lined up for those beachy days, for those sunny summery vibes. I certainly am because this list really, really excites me. It excites me a lot more than I could possibly imagine. <laughs> I look forward to wearing my fragrances, you guys. I don't know. Like I said, I'm overly excited about summer finally getting here. But yeah, I do hope you guys enjoyed this video and these selections as much as I did. If in fact you did, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Make sure to hit the notification bell so that way you will be notified every single time I upload. And for those of you who are my returning subscribers, thank you guys for supporting me. I truly appreciate your support. And until next time, see you guys in my next video. Bye.